So I'm gonna be showing you how to take apart a bike chain. Normally, you'd get a little device like this, which is meant for breaking the chain. You put the chain inside like that, and then twist this lever down, and it pops the pin out. But a lot of people don't have one of these, so I'm gonna show you how to do it without it. So the first thing we need to do is take our chain, and then find the pin that you wanna take out, clamp it down so that the pin is visible. Then I'm gonna use an angle grinder with a cutoff wheel, and we're just gonna cut the edge of this off. Then we're gonna tap that pin out with a hammer. You can see it's starting to come out as we tap it. So I've pushed the nail all the way through and popped the pin out. You can see that's how it went. There's the side that we cut. So that's how you take the chain apart. Now normally, you have a master link, like this little guy, that you would put on the chain like this to hold it together. But if you don't have a master link, or if you're working with an odd sized chain, slide a roofing nail through it, clamp it down in the vise, cut it off right about here. You only need about an eighth of an inch. So cut that out with an angle grinder. And there's our piece, the nail in it. So we're gonna take our piece, then we'll tap this part that we cut off of the nail. And you just want to hammer it till it mushrooms out a little bit because you don't want it to be tight. If you hammer it too much, it'll close the pin enough where it binds up the chain and it doesn't move back and forth. You want it to be able to flex good. But there you go. Got the nail in, riveted together. And that's a good chain. You can put that together and put it on any bike. Anyways, I hope you found this useful, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.